7.4 Addition Rule of Probability. Let's review intersections and unions along with the Venn diagrams and cardinal numbers all together. Consider an example of pulling a king, which we'll call event A, or pulling a spade, which we'll call event B, from a deck of cards. So first we want to consider event A happening or, and that's the mathematical or, event B happening. That we'll call a union. And the A union B is a king or spades. And then looking at these two Venn diagrams, which is the one that we're going to need? Because I have a king and there's, there's four kings and they're one from each suit, and then I have one of the suits, which is spades, so there will be something in that intersection. There will be a card that fits both event A and B, and that is the king of spades. So we do need this one that has the overlap in the middle, and we don't need this one because there is no overlap. And here we know we have one card, king of spades, in the middle, and event A event B, I'm thinking event A has kings, there's four kings in a deck, one of them is in the middle so we have three more left on the outside. Event B is all the spades and that's one-fourth of a deck of cards or 13 cards. I have one shown again in the middle so that leaves me 12 for not the intersection but within the event B. So then if I'm trying to find the cardinal number for A union B, and A union B, remember, is all of these together, I can look at the cardinal number for A plus the cardinal number for B minus the cardinal number for A intersect B. And thinking about it, the cardinal number for A, that was our four kings. The cardinal number for B, that is our 13 spades and then subtracting off that one king in the middle that we have shared between both of the event A and B and we end up with 4 plus 13 is 17 minus 1 will be 16. The cardinal number for the union is 16 and we can see it here if we take the 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. That is 16 cards in our union. Let's do the same thing but with and instead of the or. So this time we're saying event A happening and event B happening. And that we call an intersection and that's that upside down U. And we are talking about the kings and the spades. There's only one card and it is the king of spades. That is the only card that is a king and a spade simultaneously. And still the same Venn diagram because there's still an intersection with one in it and a 3 and a 12 over here. But this time we want this intersection region only, whereas on our previous one we wanted any numbers in the union. So that was all the way through both of the circles A and B. Here we're talking about just the ones that are in the overlap part, and that was just a single one. The intersection of the two events is going to be that king of spades. There was only one of them. And again, we did not need this diagram because we did have an overlap with those two sets.